Hey, this is the perfect day to relax, sit back, watch Marty Bass do the weather on WGZ. And we noted at 839, the first raindrops appeared on the Harbor Cam. Yeah. And they're, they're going to be with us now through at least later on Thursday afternoon, not Thursday. 72 is a high. And there's the radar with some steadier rain on the way. Take it away, Chrissy. Wrap up that commute. Good morning, Marty. Good morning, everyone. Well, the good news is the crash on the outer loop at Frederick Road has been cleared, but as you can see behind me, delays remain. There's a look at Liberty Road. Top side of the Beltway continues to run smoothly. No complaints there. We do have a couple of crashes southbound on the Jones Falls Expressway at Cold Spring Lane, then southbound Route 10 at Ritchie Highway, and northbound 95 at 32. Max? Christy, thank you. Governor Hogan issues new restrictions for bars and restaurants across the state as COVID cases rise to go in effect today. Indoor restaurant bar capacity is down to 50% from 75. There's a new travel advisor also. The governor says there should only be essential travel to about three dozen states and people should be tested upon their return. Marylanders can now get alerts about coronavirus exposure with the new app on iPhones and Androids. Maryland's health department launched MD COVID Alert. It'll say when you've been exposed to someone with coronavirus, no data is collected from your phone. All right, you know the rules. Stay with WJZ. More news and weather today at noon.